click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, in the previous lecture we have discussed about the anomalous behavior of oxygen and now in this topic we are going to talk about the preparation of dioxygen. So now let us understand in this topic and how we can prepare dioxygen. So friends, in this topic we are going to talk about that is how we can obtain that is dioxygen from the chemical reactions. So for that we have certain reaction and among that the first one is by decomposition of hydrogen peroxide. We understand that is hydrogen peroxide is a very unstable molecule and that's the reason that on thermal decomposition basically because it is very much unstable compared to that of H2. That is whenever if we heat it obviously it will produce that is H2O along with that of oxygen and in this case basically H2O is the main component that is what we could get but yes. The main thing that is what we need is we need preparation of oxygen and this is how basically we can obtain oxygen. So therefore this is one of the method where we can obtain oxygen and now let me talk about the next method. The next method is by decomposition of oxygen rich compounds. So here basically we are going to talk about the decomposition reaction of that is KClO3. So in this case KClO3 is nothing but that is potassium chlorate and in that case basically two moles of KClO3 that is it has been heated in presence of that is MnO2 so as to obtain 2 moles of KCl along with that of 3 moles of O2 so even this is a method where on decomposition of potassium chlorate we can obtain that is oxygen talking about the next one that is suppose if we decompose potassium perchlorate that is 2 moles of KCl O4 and in that case also we will get that is 2 moles of KCl along with that of 4 moles of O2 and talking about the next that is the oxidizing agent that is KMnO4 so in this case also that is 2 moles of KMnO4 whenever it has been decomposed it forms that is K2MnO4 along with the formation of MnO2 and oxygen as a byproduct and suppose if I am talking about the next reaction that is in this case we see 2 moles of K2Cr2O7 that is potassium dichromate whenever it undergoes through decomposition reaction it forms 2 moles of K2O along with that of 2 moles of Cr2O3 and 3 moles of O2 so again this is one of the method where we can obtain oxygen and now let me talk about the next reaction so the next reaction is by heating dioxides peroxides and higher oxides of metal suppose if we decompose that is Ag2O that is nothing known as silver oxide so in this case let me give you an example that is suppose if 2 moles of Ag2O that is silver oxide if it undergoes through decomposition reaction so therefore it will form 4 moles of Ag along with that of that is O2 so in this case the oxygen is been obtained as a byproduct but we can also prepare that is by decomposing that is the metal oxides and suppose here also suppose here we have that is PV3O4 so this is known as a red lead so whenever two moles of red lead is undergone through a decomposition reaction so therefore it will form that is PVO that is lead oxide along with that of that is evolution of oxygen that is O2 and talking about the next one that is mercury oxide so in this case we see if it undergoes through decomposition it will form mercury two moles of mercury along with that of oxygen as a byproduct suppose if I'm talking about lead dioxide so in this case even this could undergo through decomposition reaction so as to get that is lead oxide along with that of O2 as a byproduct. So this is all the reaction where we can obtain oxygen. And talking about the other reactions that is whenever that is H2 is electrolyzed so obviously in that case we could obtain H2 as well as O2 so in that case also we could obtain oxygen. So therefore these are the certain reactions where we have got to know that is how basically the oxygen is basically prepared. So thank you friends for watching this video. I hope you have understood this video very clearly and I hope I will see you next time. Till then don't forget to subscribe to channel. Thank you so much.